Hello guys and welcome back to another Fallout 4 Mod Spotlight. This time we're going to be checking out Cheat Terminal, uh, made by um, Nexus AU and G G G 489 you, you, you see the names when I when I said the mod name. <laughs> anyway, uh, G Gur 489 I think. So um, this mod is kind of self-explanatory. Um, it pretty much does what the console menu here does. Uh, in case you're wondering, um, it it just makes a cheat menu appear in your uh, pet boy or on your pet boy. So you see this menu here called Cheat Terminal Portable. You just kind of click on that, and uh, you now have all the console commands at your disposal, pretty much. You can add perks, items, some actual cheats, some quests. You can kind of just bypass and whatever, and alter the game, personal storage. You can just teleport to locations, some downloadable content. You can just kind of activate. And then you can spawn NPCs, and then you can configure some other stuff. You can also add uh, mods to this thing, but like the vanilla stuff is kind of all you need, so there's not really any need for it. Now, this is also available on Xbox One and on Bethesda.net. I don't know if it's available for PlayStation, um, but this is console friendly, and it's technically made for consoles. You can use it on PC too. I am currently using it on PC, but I'm only using it because... Um, I, I like using controller. I don't really like using keyboard and mouse, so I just use this, and it's way simpler. Like, if you don't want to know codes and stuff for the console, this is just an easier way of doing it. That's why you might want to use this one. Or even if you, let's say you completed Fallout 4, right? You know, mess around with it. See how much you can break the game. See, see much, how much you can push the engine to its limits and stuff. This is a fun mod to make mess around with. Check out the different perks, different things. If you're making videos like me, it's also useful to... um to alter the game state and, and certain things to spawn different NPCs. Uh, so, so it's kind of it's kind of cool to uh, to see exactly what uh, what kind of stuff you can just mess with with this thing. But there's not much more to it. It's pretty much just like it says a cheat terminal uh, you have in your pit boy. It's like a cheat menu you have in your pit boy if you ever want to cheat something in the game. If you if you want to play with an immersive experience without anything, I would not recommend using this. But if you just kind of want to mess around and have fun, I mean, go ham. Uh, so, yeah, that's kind of all to this one. Uh, there's not much more to it. It's just a menu that allows you to cheat on consoles. Or if you're using a controller and you don't want to do this all the time and type in, like, weird things here and then go ahead and, uh, like, as an example, TGM is scarred mode. Uh, the, the, the console menu can do the same uh, as a cheat instead of you having to type it. So, this is way more simple. That's kind of the whole point of it. Um, I will leave a link to the actual mod called Cheat Terminal in the description in case you want to check it out. Um, and uh, yeah, just read about what it does. I always encourage you guys to read the description of the mod itself in case there are some things that they wanted to change or add. Uh, but just know that everything you can do in the Cheat Terminal is is like it's actually less than what you can do in the console here. But you have all the essentials in there, so you don't really need to use the console that much. Um, but yeah, that's going to be for this video. I hope you guys found it useful or helpful. I uh, also hope you guys enjoyed watching it. If you did, consider liking, subscribing, and sharing. Hope to see you guys in another Mud Spotlight or in another one of my Let's Plays. And as always, stay awesome.